Embodied energy is important in any material because it is all of the energy that was used to create that material. Uh, you know, if we're talking about lumber, somebody had to get in their truck in the beginning of the day and drive out to the forest, and they got in a big truck, and then you know a bunch of guys drove out. They cut the tree down. They had fuel in their saws. They cut that tree down. That tree took sun and years of light to grow, and they cut it down, bring it back. You know, as you go down that path, everything starts to collect energy on that material to get it to where it is. You know, so if it's a piece of maple flooring or it's a piece of lumber, whatever it is, by the time you're holding it, there's a tremendous amount of effort that went into that. Uh, you know, obviously, modern manufacturing really tries to reduce that energy because energy usually costs money, but you still end up with it. And so when you throw that material away, you lose everything that was used to create it. And so when you save it, um, you know, or you're able to find a new owner for it, that energy gets transferred. Uh, and they don't have to go buy it to the store and buy that same identical thing that somebody else is throwing away that also has all that embodied energy. And so that transition uh, really saves all the energy that was put into it.